Hi, I'm Nancy with Factory Direct Crafts, and today we're going to be making a lit tool garland. It's going to be very pretty. Uh, you're going to need some of these um, Chanel stems in white and with not a lot of fuzz on them, some, kind of small. And you're going to cut those into two inch sections. You're going to need a, a string of lights that are white. The wire is white in them. And you're going to need this 18 inch roll of tool. So let's get started. Okay, the first thing you need to do is cut your chenille stems into uh, little pieces. So like two inches long. Now this whole project is a lot like doing one of those mesh wreaths. And you can, I'm just using mine with just tool, but you could run ribbon through that too if you'd like to. And if you're going to do that, you might want to leave your little Chanel stems here a little longer so you can uh, run more things through them. But I'm leaving mine plain just because I, I want it to be able to go with whatever. But like if you're hanging this in a little girl's room or something like that, you might want to have a, add a, a ribbon to it. Okay, so here we go. We've got this long thing of tool. It's 18 inches wide and it's a huge roll so it's going to last for the whole thing and more. And what you do here is you take your, your uh, tool and you take it and you go around your light and you um, bunch it up a little bit. So see I've got this kind of pocket in there and you go around both sides with it. Okay. And then I'm going to take my little um, pipe cleaner thing here and I'm going to wrap it around here and because they're white they don't really show you don't really notice them at all wrap it around and this is when uh, you could go and then you could add your ribbon through there if that's what you want to do and now I just go to the next uh, um, over top the next light and make it as big and fluffy as I want. Take the next one and I just continue down my string of lights. So once you know how to do it, it's not complicated at all and it really turns out pretty. Do it again and you just continue down through your hole there we go. And at Christmas, you could add some red to it or um, red and green. You could hang it on, put it on your Christmas tree. There's a lot of things you could do with it. And I think it looks really pretty. 